Don't be a weirdo. I don't know if you saw the video uh, earlier this week at the All-Star Game. There's like a 45-year-old grown man amongst a mountain of kids, 12, 13, 11 years old, trying to get autographs and players, and he's literally elbowing these kids out of the way. The reason I bring this up is the Bills are now in town at St. John Fisher University, and there are legitimate stars here, arguably for the first time since the Bills have been at Fisher. Problem is, if you didn't get tickets to go to training camp, well, you can't get in, and they're all sold out. There have been people on social media and Reddit this week in Rochester asking out loud where they can go hang out in Pittsford outside of the campus to meet players that might be walking around shopping and buying food. And it's funny, in every one of these posts, they say, you know, I'm not a weirdo. By the way, if you have to write that down, you are a weirdo. You have, can't clarify I'm not a weirdo by saying that you are a weirdo. The point I'm making is this, man. These guys, some of them, have faces you instantly recognize. And the second they walk out the door, they're going to be mobbed. Other guys have never done this before. They're trying to make this team, and they may feel obligated to stop and take time to talk to people. Look, man, get your autographs, take your pictures, have fun. But don't be that weird person. Because just like that guy that got caught on video with that baseball in his hand, somebody's going to have video of what you're doing. And you don't want to be that person that lives on for the next 10 years as that guy on Twitter who tackled James Cook coming out of the TJ Maxx in Pittsburgh Colony Plaza. Trust me on that. Good luck at your autographs this summer.